Hi and welcome back to Heaven Eris London. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm really glad that you're here. Thank you for watching. So I'm not feeling 100% today guys. I've got a cold but I really felt compelled to bring this message to at least one person out there. I'm very convicted that at least one person needs to hear this message and what I have to say. So it is that time of the year, guys. Yes, it's Valentine's season where the, the whole world is abuzz with love. And I know that this can be a very difficult time of the year for some people, uh, especially single people who get reminded of the fact that they're not in relationships. And I really wanted to just bring you some comfort to know that you do not have to feel alone at this time and you do not have to sit at home feeling sorry for yourself. I know that it's easier said than done, but I thought to bring you some very practical things that you could do to get your mind off the season or off the day. So the first thing I would suggest is find something that really makes you happy, you know, spend time doing that thing that makes you happy or, you know, treat yourself for the day, go to a spa, catch up with a friend, have dinner with a friend, have dinner with your family, you know, just basically focus your mind on things that make you happy so that that essentially takes that energy away from the negatives that you feel around this time of the year and you put it into something that adds value to you. The second thing I would suggest is please stay off social media, especially if you know that's your trigger. There is no point spending hours and hours scrolling through social media and being reminded of the fact that you're not coupled up. Why not spend that time doing something productive? Guys, it's just one day of the year. The third thing I would recommend is if you feel very, very depressed about this season, make sure you speak to someone about it. Speak to someone you know would give you comfort, someone who's willing to listen. Um, and be very mindful about who you talk to about it because some people might actually make you feel worse. I think that part of the problem is that we focus on the commercial aspects of Valentine's Day. So the flowers, the chocolates, the gifts. And we forget that it's actually a season to celebrate love as a whole. You know, Eros love, Agape love. Uh, why not spend that time showing love to someone that you know is perhaps desolate or alone? Spend time with your family, do something that makes you happy, don't wallow, don't spend time feeling sad and sorry for yourself, it's just one day. And don't forget that we all have different journeys in life, we all have different parts in life. For someone, this is a period in their life where they are meant to be in a relationship, and for other people, perhaps it's your time to be single. And not everything that glitters is gold. So for some people in relationships, they might be very envious of you who's single thinking, gosh, I wish I was single because I cannot bear to spend one more day with this person that I'm with. And not everything that looks perfect is. So these are things that you need to consider, especially for younger people who might feel very pressured to get into relationships that they actually do not want to be in because they feel like they have to be part of the crowd. Don't feel that way. Be yourself, love yourself, and be comfortable being single. It's not a taboo. It's not a forbidden thing to be single. Enjoy it, guys, because one day, guess what? You will be in the relationship, and you might actually miss the time that you had no one to be accountable to. Enjoy this time in your life. Embrace it. Spend time getting to know yourself. Spend time getting to love yourself. And don't forget, guys, that above everything else, God loves you so much, just as you are. And you don't need someone else in your life to feel wholesome or to feel complete. Okay, my darlings, I really hope this has helped someone out there. Please don't forget to like or comment or subscribe. I would love to hear from you. And I would love to hear um, how other people deal with this time of the year and what your you know, recommendation would be to those who are finding it very difficult. And for those of you who are celebrating Valentine's, happy Valentine's Day. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I've really enjoyed spending time with you, and I will see you very shortly in my next video.